Tonight, a U.S. Navy warship is on a mission to rescue a very sick baby girl from a sailboat that is stranded off Mexico's Pacific coast. How the baby and her parents came to be there in the first place is raising a few questions. Marley Hall is tracking the story. There are eight people crowded on board the sailboat Rebel Heart tonight, including four Air National Guardsmen and one very relieved family. Eric and Charlotte Kaufman, their three-year-old daughter Cora, and baby Lyra were two weeks into the latest leg of an around-the-world trip. But one-year-old Lyra came down with a fever and all-over rash, just as the 36-foot boat lost power and stalled in the water nearly 1,000 miles from Cabo San Lucas. Family members like April Morissette now just hope for a safe return. I hope that they all come back safe. That's what I want. Medics parachuted onto the sailboat with medicine Friday and remain on board tonight as they wait for a naval ship from San Diego to meet up with the boat. Major Brian Finnerty says the mission is going well so far. The baby, based on our latest update, is uh, stable um, and she's being treated for illness and so right now she's, she's in good condition. The couple started their trip from San Diego in 2012 with daughter Cora taking time off when baby Lyra was born in Mexico last February. They've sparked concern about bringing children on such a long trip. When she called me to tell me that she was pregnant with the little one, I said, oh, so the world trip is off, you know? And she said, no, we're still going. And I said, you're crazy. Once aboard the Navy ship, rescuers plan to sail everyone back to San Diego and take Lyra to a hospital, wrapping up a family adventure they will likely never forget. Marley Hall, CBS News.